Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast recognizes Western Armenia Malatya. Armenia and Austria celebrate the 30th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic relations. The Turkish agency Anadolu, in an article about Ani, does not mention anything about the Armenian past of the city. Archaeologist Didan Lokmajezian, the liberal youth movement of Australia has confirmed the recognition of the genocide of Armenian people and the right of Artsakh to self-determination. Get to know the historical places of Western Armenia Ayas. Armenian singer from Constantinople released a song based on Durian's poem Turtunjk. Duduk player Arsen Petrosyan was nominated for the prestigious Song Like Music Award 2022 in the nomination Best Artist. The ancient province of Malatya in Western Armenia is located in a province on Harpuk. Numerous rivers and streams flowing through the mountainous pass through the city and provide water supply. Favorable mild weather and fertile soil provide rich vegetations. From the forest they collect wild fruits, nuts, berries, vegetables, mushrooms, etc. Fishing is also developed. Various fruit trees and vegetables grow in the field. Malatya grapes are of particular importance of their abundance, variety and quality. Located on a silk road, Malatya has been a trade coast road since ancient times. The Republic of Armenia and the Republic of Austria established bilateral diplomatic relation in 1992, January 24. On these days, the party adopted a joint statement on the establishment of diplomatic relations. Armenia and Austria cooperate both in bilateral format and in international organizations, the UNOSCE. For 30 years, the government of Armenia and Austria have signed 12 agreements on cooperation, mutual assistance and partnership of six memoranda. Armenia settled on the territory of Australian Empire back in the 17th century. The Armenian community was replenished after the genocide committed against Armenians in 1915. Austria recognized the genocide of Armenian people in 2015 on April 22. The Turkish state news agency Anadolu published an article about Ani. The article, however, does not mention a word about the Armenian past of the city. It is noted that the ruins of Ani are attractive even on winter days for foreign and local tourists. The ruins of Ani of Western Armenia included in a UNESCO World Heritage List are located in the vicinity of Kars. It should be noted that a Turkish state agency has been avoiding any mention of Armenian in publication about Ani for many years. Back in 2014, Sedar Koroju wrote about this in a newspaper, Akos, in an article titled Anadolu Agency Erased Armenians from History. The medieval capital of Ani was included in a World Heritage List in July 2016, according to the statement of UNESCO President Armenak Abrahman, which was then followed by the application of the Turkish authorities. On Western Armenia TV, Turkeologist Didan Lokmajezian presented possible threats to normalization of Armenian-Turkish relations. He analyzed the image and work activities of authorities, representatives of Republic of Armenia and Turkey for the settlement of diplomatic relations, noting that he was appointed heavy artillery and on the Armenian side, having no diplomatic experience. The Liberal Youth Movement of Australia has adopted a resolution of the recognition of Armenian as free and Greek genocide in 1915, as well as the right of the indigenous Armenian people on the Republic of Artsakh to self-determination. The Youth Liberal Movement is the youth wing of Liberal Party of Australia. The Liberal Party of Australia is one of the largest political forces in the country and is currently in the federal government headed by Prime Minister Scott Morrison. In 2020, the Young Liberals adopted a similar resolution. At the time of Cilician Armenia, Ayas was considered a major trading center. The city was surrounded by fortresses, both on the land side and on the sea side. There was a time when the Armenian mint was located here. The city is surrounded by lemon and orange arcades. There are forests nearby. Participated in transit trade from the east to Europe, the Italian named the city Layas. There was a powerful citadel of which only ruins have been preserved. In connection with 130th anniversary of the Petros Turian, Armenian single Maral Ivas released a song based on his famous work Tertunj. The video is already on the official YouTube channel of Maral Ivas. The singer dedicates it to all those who sacrificed their lives while performing their military duties. The work Tertunj turned into a song by Noray Tamircha. The work is one of the outstanding works of ancient point, each line of which expresses incomprehensible sigh of author. Tertunj gives Durian's favorite speech, in which he makes the unheard voice of unhappy souls with impressive poetic comments. 
Song Alliance Music Award is a prestigious international award held for the 14th time. Every year, talented musicians from around the world are nominated for the award, and it is wild covered by international media. Duduk player Arsene Petrosan was nominated in the nomination Best Artist with his album Soul Road. Thanks to Musician's Victory, Armenian music will spread even more in the world, and the victory will be contribute to the popularization of our culture. It should be noted that Petrosan's album Soul Road released in London, in widely distributed throughout the world. Next month, Arsene will perform on tour in a number of European cities. You can vote for Arsene at the following link below. Now the musical part, Armenian folk song Chem Karnakhaga. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.